Hello everyone, welcome back to Fallout 76. So, we just checked back in with our camp. Ah! This guy responds! Alright. Can't have that. That's just, uh, horrible for the decor. So, last time, we went across the bridge. And that took forever. But it was great. It was totally worth it. Look how big it is compared to how it looks in the map. It actually starts right there to there. But it just has a little signal, a little symbol right there. But that's deceptive. Anyway, so we saw some things. There was this creamery over there that we walked right by because we were going for the teapot. So let's go and check out the creamery. And at some point, we're going to have to go back, go back to the north, um, because that's where the Overseer went next. But we can get to that eventually. Oh, look what a nice day out it is. It's a little blurry, but that's okay. <laughs> let's see what we got here today. Ghouls, bugs, or robots, scorched, ghouls, where are you at ghouls, ooh, yeah, we got the plan for a Tinker Workbench. We should make one in our home. Feral Ghoul King! Explosions. So yeah, we were- the bridge starts like pretty close to those uh those steam towers over there. Well, maybe I'm wrong. That's where the the teapot thing was. Never mind. I am all wrong about everything. Cream. Just a uh, restorative HP. Hello. Hey, 750. Oh, I hear noises. Am I missing us 95? Whatever. It's not like they hit for like anything. Yeah, if I have a complaint, well, and I have many complaints, I am good at complaining. It is one of my skills. But if I had a complaint at the moment, it would be that things die. They take too long to die. You do too little damage, and they do too little damage to you. Like, I haven't felt worried, except for once when we, like, got attacked by, like, a ridiculous number of things. And they were, like, super mutants or something? I don't remember. But I haven't, like, felt at risk. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Amy Carey, I thought you might have been a ghoul. In fact, it looks like you were a ghoul. Maybe. All right. So you don't have like a story associated with you, I don't think. There's just a creamery. Come on, come on. Uh oh. 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 
Okay. Well, disappointing. Maybe some sort of event can happen here? I don't think so. I'm not seeing like a lot of interactable things. Nope. Just a little random area. Filled with ghouls. A chance to scrap some items, perhaps. Anything in these houses? Not even openable. Nope. They're not real houses, they're fake houses. Alright, but we have lots of little, um, lots of little map markers to work our way towards. There's a forest right here, or some sort of nature area. Full of spriggans, I'm sure. Another Mr. Farmhand. Ooh, windmill. They don't even fight back. Like, they're red, but they're not attacking. Maybe because we changed their... Uh, ooh, double quantum. Nice. Okay, there's some rad barrels there. Orwell Orchards. Let's take... Uh... Let's just see, if we never attack him, are you just gonna walk around? Yeah. Okay, we'll leave we'll live and let it live. Leave him alone. Until someone attacks me. <clears throat> well, you got a you got a lantern. And you attacked me! Not a lantern, what am I saying? You have a, you have a crown. There. Although, I don't know. It doesn't seem like they offer good things. Here. Cheryl's journal. Ian went to Charleston today to ask for another loan. The bank turned him down again. I'm not sure what we'll do now. We knew this year might be rough, but I doubt even we we can even pick a hundred bushels from the trees outside. These oil traps didn't do much to stop our mouth our moth problem, and we can't afford enough insecticide without some serious help. I don't know where we can get that kind of money. No matter what, this fall's crop is mostly gone. That was like a few days before the, uh, the, uh, event. The bombs. Welcome to the farm of the future, from Fortnite. Ooh, an auto pistol. Let me see if it's, I'm looking for a level 10 one, but we're not finding him. Gathering biological. <laughs> it's like they all switched back to attacking me now that I um, saw that guy. Oh well, never mind. Hello? Are you gonna be angry? Yep. Good. I feel less bad killing them when they can fight back.
Is that a level, t level 10? I wish I would just kind of say. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> you startled me, dude. Lucky Hits Lottery Recording. Dear Mr. and Mrs. Bennett Orwell, we of the West Virginia Lucky Hits Lottery Company are pleased to inform you of the result of our November lottery game, held on the 10th of this month. Your names are attached to Lucky Hits. Lotto ticket 59, 28, 42, 88. We are overjoyed to tell you that this ticket was November's Lucky Lottery winner. It's the largest single month game in Lucky oh Hits God. history. You are hereby approved to receive an immediate cash payment in the amount of $300,000. Mr. and Mrs. Orwell, congratulations! A local Lucky Hits Prize representative will be arriving at your residence on November 30th, just a few <laughs> short days away. To avoid any unnecessary mix-ups, please contact our headquarters as soon as possible to confirm your home address. Now we advise that it's in your best interest to keep this news from the public's attention. We value all of our Lucky Hits customers, and we can't wait to hear from you. Once again, congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Orwell, winners of West Virginia's largest ever lottery game. So, on the one hand, they were having trouble keeping their farm going and didn't know what to do. But then they won the lottery. So, you know, that's good. But then the world ended and there was nuclear fire everywhere. So that's bad. I think on the whole bad. Hello, dudes. Baseball bat broken. Okay. Okay, so like I'm saying, we just got mobbed by a five group of five ghouls. Do I feel threatened? I'm at 85% health. <laughs> a weak ghouls, but still. I mean, I don't know. Hopefully it'll scale a bit more scary in the future. Single action revolver. That's new. I haven't seen that. What is that? Uses 44 ammo. Damage 50 compared to the actual 44. We'll have to take a look. Uh, wait, was that level? That was level 10. That might be okay. Let's um, let's find a workbench or a um. I guess we could just travel home. There are enemies nearby. That probably didn't help things. Nope, it did. So we used up our bat, which means I think it's just gone, right? What is going on? Can't see who they're firing at. Oh, uh, they're bad. Okay, we've done this before, so we'll just we'll kill the one and then we'll go home. I 
I just didn't expect the Wanderers to be bad. But whatever. Uh... That was not as effective as I thought it would be. Okay. That was exciting. <laughs> if you leave, you won't receive a reward. Ah, I don't care. I've already done the quest. All right. No idea. Must have been another respawn protectron or something. I don't know. I don't care. We're hidden. What's an apple? Apple of chili. <laughs> It's not even that much HP. But whatever, sure. Double luck. This healing salve. I want to make a ton of that, because that's light and gives me good HP restoration. So, we need blood leaf for that, and soot flower. Blood leaf you find along, um, along rivers. Alright, um, so we were going to... Not craft. I wanted to modify. So this baseball bat we can repair. For cheap. This single action revolver I was curious about. Like we can't modify it much. We have this ivory grip. Let's go ahead and switch over to that. So, um, we'll put away our uh, pipe revolver, which did 37 damage every five, and this does every six, but more damage. But it uses 44 rounds, so we'll have to switch ammo types. Um, what do I want? I want 44. There we go. And we'll quick slot it. Too bad we can't upgrade it more. Alright. Um, we're hungry. No, we're not. We would already dealt with that. Corpse flower? Where'd I get that? I don't remember. Alright. Okay. Let's head out somewhere. 
So we've been that way. We got those through markers. Looks like there's a sheep off to the northwest. Maybe we should head that way. I don't know. I feel like we've been that way several times. Maybe we should just skip all this and um, head for our next quest. Morgantown Airport or go to Grafton. Let me just see where this is sending me. Show on map. Show on map. Why would it show on map? Maybe I don't know the location. Yeah, we did that protest march event. I think it was there. Yeah, we've been to Grafton. Okay, so we don't know the location for this. We'll just bump into... Well, wait a minute. No, no map marker. Find the next journal in Sutton. Where is that? That's pretty close. Sure, we'll go that way. Um... Where are we? We're... We're right here. We could just... Get up on the railroad. And follow the way up. Need to test our new revolver. Thank you for volunteering. Oh, I like the reload. That that reload animation is cool looking. I do enjoy the mechanics of guns. You're bad, right? Yeah. We have all this 308, might as well burn it too. So they were fighting some scorched. You know, we used to see Protectrons all over the place, and they were always friendly because they were responders. Did we do something to anger the responders? What is that? Hanging off the bridge there? It's a, it's a dude. A dead dude, but still. I should probably leave the first area before the beta finishes. <laughs> Ooh, a little cabin up here. I think we've already been here. Maybe. You know, I think it is keeping track of whether I've looted stuff here before. And not, like, replenishing these. Maybe. Yeah, I remember this raider corpse. In fact, no. 
now. Yes, this is this is where the um, this is the lodge area. But there weren't any bugs here last time we were here. Oh well. And here's the pool, and there was a mire lurk in the pool. Oh, we never looted you. So we were going to go to that train station and then go north, or we could just go straight to it. It keeps you in iron sights a bit too long. Like I release the button and then it has to finish reloading and then it lets me out of iron sights. It's a little annoying. Well, of scope mode, not iron sights, necessarily. There we are, Sutton. Ooh. Wow, this area is much more dangerous than the one we just were at. Maybe that's good. It's actually like level appropriate. I'm pretty sure we killed more Scorch than that. Hello. Congratulations! Yay! You have been randomly selected to win a fabulous prize from the Great Appalachian Sweepstakes. The Great Appalachian Sweepstakes is not responsible for the annual <laughs> gift tax. Failure to do so may be reported to the IRS. Enjoy your prize! Thanks, man. Okay, um... So we just got some weapons. Are any of those level... 10. No. No. Stump knows true. But unfortunately. 48 verse 50. Like, we have more upgrades for the 44 because we've been wrecking them. But, um. Oh well. We found some apparel also. But that's not any better. Pocketed, boiled, left. Our left arm's good though, right? Our left arm is Vanguard. So that was all waste. Never mind. Look at that. I love it. <laughs> it's slow, it's really slow, but I like the mechanics of it. It's got a nice satisfying slam. I think I hear a pup. We'll get the note in a moment. Come on, where are you? Is 
It's those missed 95% shots that get you. It's like we're playing XCOM. Alright. Body shop note. That is so... Okay. Why is this so hard? I thought using the traps would make it so much easier to deal with a large number of large group of idiots all at once. I wrecked the damn vehicle though, so I can't keep doing this the same way. It takes so much time and effort to deal with the aftermath. Yesterday I found some people looting my kills. Can you imagine the audacity? I told them that I just barely survived the maniac that did this and that he's been killing people in Sutton since everything went sideways. I convinced them that I am a religious person. Can you believe that? Me. I know, it's a total gas. Well, I was wearing some black clothes, and I had a bunch of wine, so it works. They're going to come pray with me at my church. <laughs> okay, this is going a lot better than I expected. This place sucks. I'm going to put all my effort into messing with these idiots. I convinced them that they need to give up their worldly stuff because they're like actually immortal amnesiacs. I was a little altered in thinking about Captain Cosmos' deep lore, but they believed it. I can't believe how stupid these people are. I can make a piano! <laughs> I can now construct pianos. Sure. So yeah, this guy... He's... He had this vehicle, and he's been... Carting home bodies in it. That's pleasant. Tinker workshop. Ooh, come on, come on. No, darn it. Someday, someday, it'll happen. Free, that's my stash. Let's, um, break up everything. Didn't even teach me pocketed. Disappointing. Actually, we haven't looked at like one of these for real in a while. Is there something we can craft here? It's all about ammo crafting. Yeah, I can make more 44 if we want. With lead and gunpowder. It's not a lot. I mean, only three gunpowder for 15 rounds? Wow. Like, I, I get kind of get the point that they don't want me to have to worry about ammo. Here, let's just do that. And we can bulk these, right? Which makes them all, um, way less. Anyway, we're close to leveling. That's good. Ooh. Somebody was putting out traps. Alright, uh, where's our stash? Right there. I heard a gasp. Scorched. I have to say, I think it's a bit of sophistry to say that this game does not have NPCs. I mean, the Scorched are basically raiders. I'm not seeing 
you know. They even talk. Like, this is a raider base. It just flat is. Oh well. Doesn't matter. Interesting. Think we should go for a jump? Uh, that was that wasn't that big of a deal. We have lock picking one. We just don't have it equipped right now. Oh, apparently I have a level also. Okay. There we go, gunsmith. We're definitely getting gunsmith. And we're just gonna spam gunsmith for a while. Okay. Um, what am I doing? I was going to... I was going to say... What was I doing? I don't remember. <laughs> I was saying we were going to switch to... Pick locking. Which we don't have. Never mind. We're gonna have to pick it up. We have hacking, right? We have hacking one. No, we don't. We we're going to get hacking one, but then we changed our minds. So never mind. I'm just wrong in all respects. Not much here. I like the chimes. See, there's even raider corpses here. <laughs> ah. So this is the church of the dude that was uh, laughing about how stupid people are. Ah, leader's journal. I can't believe how these people are responding. It says it's even better than I imagined. It's so much easier than trying to round them up and kill them for their stuff. I just need a willing fool to do most of the work for me. There's more every day. Maybe Yves or Margaret. Oh yeah, I should go with Margaret because nobody will ditch me for an old lady. Yves might be able to outstrip me with that silky pompadour and easy smile. I should get him to shave it off. Okay. Um, always with the questions, Margaret. Well, I have bad news for you. Nobody who asks that many questions is going to ever self-actualize properly, unless they learn how to clear out the barriers that cause them such stress. I'll let her know privately that I think she has a serious problem that only loyalty can help her work through. Maybe she got betrayed in a past life, and that's why she's unable to trust. Margaret found me wearing a new recruit silk pants, and she's beginning to suspect what's really going on. I just have to keep appealing to her vanity so that she can teach the new people the ropes. That and smile beatifically and say 
profound things so that everyone remembers who is holy and in charge. Not that true. Nobody is following a shrew into enlightenment, Margaret. Okay, who knew religious people could be so sanctimonious about silken pants? Nobody cares, Margaret. But she's convinced that she's got me figured out. That I am corrupt. I told her I would step down after my next sermon where I confirm her as the new leader. It's all I can do to keep her from outing me in front of everyone like a complete hag. I've got her fooled though. I can still make it out of this with the good stuff. I didn't think it would be so awful. No wonder they use it on rats. It's terrible. I have to go. I can't be here with this. The smell. I'm sure I can find another group that needs my help, just like this one. I just need to find a better way to end things next time. The smell's not gonna go, so I might as well. So we kill this congregation. Well. Um, I don't think we finished exploring up. What? Oh, they're mole rats. Mole rats are annoying. Just pop up out of me or something. List of parts. This bird's not going anywhere with soon, but I did a full check and here's what I need to get her in the air again. Hawaii or bust. Brake linings, whatever. I like your positive attitude. This music, it's very nice. Yeah, that's just lovely. I love it. Okay, let's go and explore the town a bit more. Find this thing. The journal. There we go. Just a moment. Just a moment. Is this our old house, perhaps? Yeah, Virginia Vault Tech University. This is probably where she grew up. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. I'm home. Sorry, it's been so long, but I I couldn't 
can get away. I know neither of you is around to hear this. I miss you. I miss watching Dad braid papers on the living room table. I miss the three of us huddled around the radio, listening to the silver shroud. Dad, you were right about what living underground would really be like. 25 years locked in with the same people was a challenge. But watching them pair up, get married, have children, well, I think I got to know a little bit of what you and Mom were always telling me. Well, since I'm doing this whole trip down memory lane, maybe a walk over to the old high school is in order. Aren't they poignant? This game has a uh, a nice feel to it. That's a level 10 pipe pistol. Okay, we're going to keep that around. Might expand it. So it's as good as this one. Like it's already at 18 damage and this one is really upgraded. Okay. Another requisition. We get so many of those. Okay, so... Way over here. And this was where our first base was, like right there. Outside the mine, the other entrance to the mine. All right, let's put stuff in our stash and we'll keep going. Ah, uh, there it is. And uh, it sounds looks like the high school is a proper indoor area too, since it's not just a uh, an icon. It's a well, it's not just a marker. It's a go indoors to find the marker sort of thing. Um... Looks like there's a plane crash right there. Let's go ahead and check that out. Well, we never did go to the um, the train station there, but oh well. It looks like there's a church. Someone built. See, this is just rude. They're building their place on the road. Like a barricade or whatever. What is going on here? Was that, were those Scorch trying to become like those? Is this like a religious thing? They were like in the same pose. That's creepy. <laughs> Me 
Mega Sloth Claw. Those are awfully big. Are those like one half of, I don't even know. Harvest. Murmurs of the weak-willed, unfaithful whispers. Perhaps another offering live and screaming to help them see and sow the blasphemous moss if the harvester wills it. Seems normal to me. Yeah, it seems like this stuff is all cosmetic. It doesn't actually do anything. I just took some random damage. Scorched ashes. Huh. I think that must have been from the ones that burned to death from the Molotov, maybe? Ballot Measures Ballot Measure 6 Appalachian Prosperity Act To issue a bond of 2.6 billion to initiate and support the process of full automation of the state and local government. All workers must be phased out of the government by 2087. All workers? Okay. I guess that's the idea that um, so like the bombs fell in uh, in October so these people were insulated from the main issue they didn't they didn't have troubles until society broke down they weren't bombed and society didn't break down until after um, election day I guess I don't know Am I going like wait? Oh, no, I'm not going that far away. I didn't realize this was a different town, but that's fine. They've already caught my attention. Again, needs luck. Pick one. There's a lot of dog food in this game. Printing ballot measures. Bit of overkill. Look at them! There's a bunch of them! And they're actually starting to get a bit trickier to deal with. Like, I think the low levels were, like, excessively squishy.
Not that I'm complaining, I'm quite happy that it's getting more difficult. I'm just, I'm surprised. Pleasantly. Mothman. Look at how many there are of them, that's... Actually, I think this is probably the same group. It just respawned because somebody else walked into the area. Yeah, that guy over there was, um, crowned, so... Was he right here? No, I think he was one more building over this way. Maybe. Right here. Okay, we're so overburdened now. We really need to, um... To find a uh, crafting thing. Looks like there's a trail leading up that way. You know, I bet this guy's got a crafting thing. And we might be able to use it. I mean, they're there too. Should I worry about that? <laughs> I think maybe I'll just go by. Curious? Last words. To anyone who reads this, my group was attacked by feral ghouls while we were traveling past New, Gor New River Gorge Resort. I managed to get away, but all my friends were torn apart. I'm ashamed of this, but I was too afraid to help them. And I'm too afraid to take vengeance now. Please, if you could avenge my friends, I can't give you anything, just know I'd appreciate it. We already killed them. And it was mostly bugs, anyway. Um, I'm thirsty. Let's deal with that. That was a little creepy. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how the game is handling physics objects. Interesting. 
key to Clara's box. Mom, I'm so sorry that my research got you addicted to this swill. I'll get revenge on the bastards, bastards in marketing that did this, I swear to you. I love you and I miss you so much. Nuka Cola? She's addicted to Nuka Cola? That's it? Really? Uh, there's no key. I mean, who doesn't love a Nuka Cola? Oh well. I mean, sometimes they're quantum even. I'm gonna have to remember that chest. Clara. Clara's chest. Key to Clara's box. I don't know why I'm crawling. That was a mistake. Alright. Level 10 pipe revolver. But we, we have moved on from pipe revolvers. We're not using them anymore. We already have a hunting rifle at level 10. Our shotgun is still level 5, but they're only giving me level 5s, so that's okay. And we don't use switchblades. Am I not wearing something? I don't have a right arm. And I just deleted one. So, whoops. Some mole rat meat. Okay, that's good enough. Oh, we could put some ammo in, probably. Yeah, we don't use forty five anymore. Okay, let's head back to Halvisha. Ooh, it looks like there's other people there. Maybe we'll leave that alone. For now. You know what? Let's just go spin the caps and go to vault -Tec University. Well, actually, wait a minute. Let's look to see our other quests. So, Grafton Mare. But that's like way up north, right? Morgantown and Grafton are the next places to go. That's the ghouls. We're actually pretty close to that. We might as well do it. So Morgantown is what we'll do next. After this. Maybe I, sh uh, maybe I shouldn't be so stingy with the caps. Although I love finding places when we're traveling between things. I think disabling fast travel in, um, in, in survival mode was excellent. It really changed the character of the game.
So there's somewhere in here. I'm betting that guy in the T pose must be a ghoul. <laughs> Hello? I remember killing that guy. This is almost broken, I'm gonna repair it. Hey, there's a ghoul. Come back here. We already went through and looted this entire place, so this is just gonna be about killing ghouls and stuff. Well, apparently we never got this chem box. I'm bad at lock picking. No, we did get that chem box. Never mind. Yeah, I remember this house. Ah, so how many ghouls do we need to kill? Ah. Enough that the dead guy is satisfied that we avenged his friends. Is that a camera? Yeah. Maybe we didn't come in here. No, we did. I remember thinking that it was all ransacked and not had nothing was here. Cop cap. That is totally our new hat. Yeah, yeah, I like it. There it is. Only one left? Is that what's pointing me at? No? Perhaps. For only one house left. Ah, 
Oh, there we go. We got XP done. Okay. All right, let's travel back to our camp and we'll repair our weapons up and that sort of thing. We'll switch over. Well, tr we'll see what we can mod with our um, our new gun nut one. Stupid. Scorched. What is going on over there? Is that a vent gun? No. Yes it is. Fertile soil. So we wanted to go ahead and craft our pipe pistol up so it's awesome. Well, first of all, let's repair some things. And then we'll just go ahead and... Wow, we have so many things. You know, I think I would like it to be an automatic. That'd be cool. So we have a focused automatic. And we have a tweaked. Improved critical? We're not using criticals. In fact, I don't even know exactly how to use a critical. So, we'll go with that. We're actually a little low on screws, of all things. So since it's a um, since since it is an automatic, maybe recoil would be better. Like a stabilized long barrel, I'm thinking might be good. And we're probably going to want um, improved capacity, if we can. And we're definitely going to want armor pen. So let's go for the stinging. And our reflex sight, of course. And we can get rid of our old one now. The new one actually does less damage, but it fires faster, maybe. Oh, I should actually see if I can do stuff with the other weapons I have. Now that we have uh, Gunsmith 1. Not with this one. We don't know anything else for this one. And then for the shotgun... We don't have the skill for it. Nope. We need to find more of these types of weapons and break them down. Yeah, let's um, rat away. Back down to 98. I think the difference is meat. And flowers and such. That's fine. Okay, I'm gonna take a break here before we move on, and then we will continue into Morgantown. That's my plan for next time. So thank you everyone for watching until next time.